hope you can still go I never answered a no, man, I still go Go, go Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel. I do appreciate you once again for joining me. Today, I want to talk about Christianity. Shocker! Dave's going to talk about Christianity. Yeah, fun. So, I think it's pretty damn ironic, funny in some cases, to, where, to when Christians see the horrible shit that Christians do in the name of Christianity, and then try to pretend as if that's not what Christianity is all about. But don't take my word for it. I'm going to show you the video. This is some video from a show called Indisputable on uh, The Young Turks. This is a Dr. Richie, I believe his name is. And he has a lot of shows that he does. And he's obviously a Christian. He doesn't believe in white Jesus, but boy, he's a Christian. And you should probably just, we'll just let you get a taste of what it is that he's upset about today. Christ will come Jesus down on you here. very soon. Oh, the fist of Christ. You're I done know. with yeah. this. Is that your fist? You're done with this. It's your fist. It's your fist. It's your fist of Christ. You disgust me. Groover, Groover, Groover. You guys are disgusting. Repent. Repent for your sin. Every single mother of God, every single one. The sheriffs in Texas and Dale have to be gone. Look at our town a little bit. Look at our town a little bit. Look at our town a little bit. That's what the bad thing is. I'm not trying to do it. Let us take it aside. I'm so sick and damn tired of people like that using Christianity to divide, to justify physical violence to other individuals. Not to walk in the spirit of love or coalition building a unity, but to create destruction, disunity. So what I don't understand is why this man is upset and or shocked by Christians. These people say tout themselves as being Christian fascists, but I'm not sure why he's upset about people who are Christians saying and doing exactly what the Bible and their God has instructed them to do. To hate gays, brutalize them, and discriminate against them. The Bible is full of just those things. Discrimination and hate and murder and rape and all kinds of great things. But this guy, Dr. Ritchie, who's a Christian, still doesn't seem to understand. I don't think he's read the Bible. And if he has read it, he's done like so many other Christians, every Christian that I'm that I know has ever done. And that's skim over it, know a few verses that make them feel good or sound good, and then they move on, you know, and forget about the other stuff. You know, specifically him being a black man, being a Christian, you know, when Christianity says that, hey, slaves obey your earthly masters. Fuck that. So this guy. <laughs> is upset about Christians doing what Christians are supposed to do per their own Bible. It's telling them to do these things. Why is he upset? I can tell you why he's upset. Because for him as a Christian, he feels as if that's just not Christian. But he should probably really, I mean, honestly, and I, and I implore him to literally actually read the Bible, especially when you get to the parts about slavery, about Moses and slavery, about the Pharaoh and slavery, about all the horrible things as far as raping a woman and her being forced to marry you. These things are in the Bible. Murdering 40 something kids by sicking bears on them because you don't like being called bald. The Bible and Christianity is a horrible fucking thing. It is based specifically on fascism. You need to believe, hold, I won't even go there. I'll just say the Inquisition, if you, <laughs> the Inquisition, if that's not fascism I, and murder for no fucking reason, I don't know what is. But with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, this is just a short video about this 
gentleman, Dr. Richie, uh, yeah, Rashad Richie, I think his name, not being able to fathom why Christians are horrible fucking people and do horrible fucking things. He needs to read the Bible. I implore him. He'll never see this video, maybe. But I implore him to read the damn Bible and take the rose-colored glasses off when he does. Because Christianity, just like most other religions, is fucking horrible. Specifically, the Abrahamic religions are just fucking horrible. Read the goddamn Bible, sir. Stop trying to put it on just bad actors. You're all bad actors because you're faking some shit. And you're believing some shit that is fucking fascist, hateful, racist, and just out and out fucking false and a lie. That being said, ladies and gentlemen, have a great day. Please enjoy yourself. Stay out of trouble if you can. And by all means, please be the best heathen that you can be. And have a great day.